Okay, we've got a very nice question to start with then. We've got to find dy by dx for y equals x to the power 4 plus x to the power 3rd plus 3. Now, each term has the form y equals ax to the power n, so you should be familiar with terms of the form ax to the power n when it comes to differentiating them. All you need to do is you multiply a with the power n to give a n and then just reduce the power by 1. So I would put therefore dy by dx equals, so for the first term we've got a 1x to the power 4 so it's going to be 4 times 1 is 4, reduce the power by 1 and you've got x to the power 3. For this term n is the third, we've got a 1 at the front here so it's going to be again 1 times a third which is going to be plus a third and then just reduce the power by 1 so if we take 1 off a third we end up with minus 2 thirds. When it comes to constants remember that this is just a special case of this where n is to the power 0 so when it comes to constants like a dy by dx turns out to be 0. So differentiating the 3 with respect to x, well that just is 0, so no need to put it on the end. And that's essentially the answer. But if you did want to tidy this up further, just as an exercise, then the second term cleans up. We can think of x to the minus 2 thirds as 1 over x to the power 2 thirds. I'll just write it in for the moment as 1 third times 1 over x to the power 2 thirds. And then if you multiply that fraction out, what you're going to get is 1 times 1 is 1, all over 3x to the power 2 thirds. So there's an alternative version, but as I say, you can leave it like that.